Welcome to episode number 5 of this Vinny J uh, Madden 23 Face of the Franchise series. Uh, and today, I'm obviously playing my Vinny J Madden 23 Face of the Franchise series. Uh, as you can see on the screen, well, that does look new what what's on the screen right now. Or what's on the screen right now that is new, at least for you guys. Um, that is Vinny J's house that I didn't buy. I think someone just gave it to me. I can't really remember how I got it. But I'm pretty sure that I th there was some cutscene off camera, and a guy said, This is your house now, or something. It was something like that. Be the way he got this mansion, or house, or whatever this is. Uh, as you can see, it's Vinny J right there playing Madden. In Madden, really. As, as, that, as, that is, as that is him sitting on the couch right now, playing, like I said, Madden. In Madden. Um, uh, it's week number 14. You can see right there, hopefully, the lighting's not really bad, or if it's not really bright. We're 11-1, as it says right there. We're about to put 3-9 Ravens. Yeah, I, didn't, I don't expect the Ravens to be 3-9. In real life, they're what? I don't know. I think they're hovering around 500. But in this game, they're 3-9. And, and we're 11-1. And in real life, the Steelers are like 4-7. and seven. But in this game, they're 11-1. As let's look at the playoff uh, pitcher because it is past week 13. Because in week 13, the playoff pitcher is made available, and now it's week 14. As you can see, we are the one seed. We're 11 and 1. Chargers are the two seed, and they're also 11 and 1. But we have the tiebreaker. I'm not sure what the tiebreaker is, but we have it. So we're the one seed, while the Chargers are the two seed. Bills three seed. Colts four seed. Broncos five seed. Jaguars, yes, Jaguars six seed, and the Raiders. Uh, round out the AFC playoff pitcher at the seven seed, and over in the NFC, you have the Rams as the top seed or as the one seed. And remember, only the one seeds get a first round bye, so the Rams are the, the Rams are the one seed. Buccaneers are the two seed. Cowboys the three seed. Packers the four seed. Saints the five seed. Bears the sixth seed, and then the rounded out the 49ers are the seven seed. And remember, in the wild card weekend or wild, super wild card weekend. Super wild card weekend, really. It's two C versus the seven seed, three C versus the six seed, and then the four C versus the five seed. And remember, there's that game on Monday night as well. Two game Saturday, three game Sunday, and then one game Monday for Super Wild Card Weekend. Uh, so yeah, like I just said right now the Rams and the Steelers are the one seeds, but that could change, especially for us because the Chargers are also 11 and one. And we do not play the Chargers this year. The Steelers do not, like I said, play the Chargers this year. In the regular season, that is. We might play each other in the playoffs, but we do not play each other here in the regular season. The Chargers and the Steelers do not play each other here in the regular season. I wish we did, but we do not. But we might in the playoffs. I'm going to show you the schedule because we do have one loss, which is off camera. It was between the last episode and this episode. As the last episode, we were still undefeated. As uh, last episode was our week 8 game against the Eagles, where we beat the Eagles 35-14. We had our bye week, and we were 8-0. and Saints, in week 10, we lost to the Saints 23-17. And, that, and, that, and then we were 8-1, and but then we beat the Bengals, beat the Colts, and then beat the Falcons. Um, so we went from 8-1 and to obviously 11-1, and and now we're here in week 14. And this episode of the series will be the last game of the regular season against the Cleveland Browns uh, at home in Pittsburgh. This game we're about to play against the Ravens is also at home in Pittsburgh. And both of these games are Sunday early games. Um, so, yeah. So we have the Ravens in this episode. Then we go to Carolina to play the Panthers. Then we host the Raiders. And then we go to Baltimore to play the Ravens again. And then, obviously, then we host the Browns in the last game of the regular season. So, yeah. So, Ravens, Panthers, Raiders, Ravens, and then the Browns. They round out the last, what, five games, right? Uh, yeah, the last five games of the 2022 NFL regular season. But, uh, we're probably going to win the AFC South, or AFC North, excuse me. And then we're probably also, hopefully, or hopefully we make the playoffs. That's almost guaranteed at this point. Not that would. Same thing for a punch in the AFC uh, North. But the one seed is going to be up in the air. 
Uh, so the one seed, I want the one seed, so we did a uh, bye week. But if, if, but if we are stuck in wild card weekend, so be it. But I would like that one seed. So we did. So we do did that first round bye. If we are the one seed, let's get into the game. Oh uh, yeah, first uh, side activities. Uh, I forgot about these. And then we'll get into the game after I did this. After I set our Vinny J's side activities. Uh, let's go with. Uh, meet and greet, I guess. Why not? Let's in on field training. Let's go with tapped and cover sets. Uh, game night here on Thursday. And then why not Yoda on Friday? And then sports massage, sports uh, sports massage uh, on Saturday. And obviously Sunday is a Game day, and then the next Monday, the day after game day, is an automatic rest day. So yeah, I'm just, I usually don't do this on-field drills because I just don't feel like doing them. So they're simulated. But yeah, I got some points here for the next game. So yeah. Now let's get into the game. Right now. We're 11 and 1. They're 3 and 9. We're both in 83 overall, though. And obviously, Vinny J uh, is our quarterback, the Steelers quarterback. We also have obviously T.J. Watt, a left outside linebacker, and then Cameron Hayward at right end. This team obviously they have, they have Lamar Jackson still, they have Mark Andrews, and Ronnie Stanley. Well, Ronnie Stanley is a left left tackle, and Mark Andrews is their uh, tight end. And then obviously, Mark and obviously Lamar Jackson is their quarterback. Let's get into it right now. There's Vaughn Miller. Right, he's on the Bills. Bills in real life are doing well. In this game, the Bills, what, were the, what, three or four seed, I'm pretty sure? Something like that. Let's watch a presentation. Alan Roach. That's me right there. FC North Showdown. J.K. Dobbins, their halfback, 94 yards on 21 carries and a touchdown last week. Oh, well done. Remember, their, their head coach is John Harbar, I believe. Our bar. John, yeah, I believe it's him. Here we go. So we hit the ball first. My uh, season goal is 30 passing touchdowns. I'm five away from that. So I'm 25 passing touchdowns. This season, Vinny J, as I just said, 25 passing touchdowns. Five away from his goal of 30. So let's start with the uh, shotgun. Let's start with inside zone split. I, I don't know, switch the camera angle here. But yeah, our head coach is Mike Tomlin. Their head coach is John Hunt. Uh, not, oh, I can't speak right now, but oh my goodness. Two yards for Naj Najee Harris, setting an eight. Let's go with the I-4, I formation that is. Yeah, Mike Tomlin's our head coach, and then John Harbar is the Baltimore head coach. Here we go. And throw at the circle, and he's got it. 13 yards on Vinny J's first pass attempt. First down, Pittsburgh. Our first first down. Our first first down of the game. Luck, a uh, gain of obviously 13 yards. Hopefully, it's a luck, 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 lucky 13. 
And that was a horrendous throw, and it's picked off. Yeah, I just, that was a bad throw, but I think the receiver, like, like, almost, like, ran away from it. I don't know what. It was my fault, though, because I threw it, but it's kind of the receiver's fault, too. But it's an interception, so that's a great, great start, right? Not a great start for uh, Pittsburgh. And so a zero interception. That's the goal for this drive. And the Ravens did go down and turn that INT into seven points. And we're now on seven nothing. Here we go. Now let's throw a circle or square. And that's Deontay Johnson. First down, Pittsburgh. Got about 20. Here we go. From the 49, 240 they go in the first quarter. Uh, 240 they go in the first quarter. Six minute quarters, by the way, or six minute quarters, by the way, six minute quarters. Another two yards for Harris. Send it down and eight again. Let's go with wheat. Let's go with post shot. From the Ravens 49 yard line. Set it in eight. And that's a throw to circle. And he broke two tackles. What a spin they did around those two guys. First down. Let's go with 94 Will here. 140 they do on the first. We're at their 39. First down. Here's Najee Harris, and he got no yards. Let's go with Pistol now. Let's go with P.A. Cross. Here we go. 110 they do on the first. And there's Triangle. He's got it. And he's all the way down to the 18-yard line. It's Cole Beasley. I believe in real life just retired like a month ago or a couple months ago, but in this game he's still playing. And he's on the Steelers. First and 10 from the 19. 35 sentences ago in the half. Or 35 sentences ago in the quarter, and I'm sapped by Fuller. But it's Kyle Fuller. 10 sentences ago in the quarter. It's a slants route. Second and 17. I don't have to snap if I'm going to. And here's a throw, and it's batted up in the air and incomplete. Third and 17 with three seconds to go in the quarter. So a coach is suggesting. Well, oh, no, it's all it's four verticals. We added it to the. We was at the set. I believe we died. It's like the eight yard line for a first or something like that. I can't really tell what yard line the first down marker is at. Here's a throw, and it's not that out of the hands of our of uh, my receiver. And in the first quarter, seven nothing Baltimore. We are in field goal range though, so hopefully uh, our Chris Boswell can hit the field goal, and he does, and we get the ball back. I think like a minute later, five eleven to go in the first half. We have the ball seven three Baltimore. And we have the ball at our own 28-yard line, or at our own 20-yard line, excuse me. And that could have been picked off. There was a defender right there, but Johnson got it. First down. Dana 20 from the 20 to the 40. I, I should look for the Chargers store at the bottom there. I haven't seen it yet, but also haven't been looking that much. Here's Harris, and Harris will get... Three is four rushes, seven yards now. Setting down in seven. There we go. Play action, and I'm sapped again. And uh, boy, that uh, was a, n another blitz, and I'm sapped, sapped by Williams. And now it's third and fourteen. We got it the midfield for a first. Here we go. And they're on with the R1, and he's got it, and he's got the first down. And I believe that's Harris, first down. Is he got about 20, and that is Najee Harris. The running back out of the backfield. Now we're in the Baltimore Territory, halfway through the center quarter. And over the middle, and that ball was jumped by the defender. And he knocked it down, set it down. Here we go. From the Baltimore 46. L.A. plays. At, the Chargers are not playing right now. Here's a run by Harris. The Chargers are playing the 2-10 Dolphins. 
it's a Sunday uh, late game, and this game I'm playing right now is a Sunday early game. So the Chargers play later today in this game. They play at what, 425 Eastern, while this game I'm playing right now is being played at what, 1 Eastern. So here we go. And here's a throw, and yeah, that was a bad throw. And it's picked off by the defender. I don't know if it's a linebacker or a safety. But it's intercepted by uh, Queen. I believe it's Patrick Queen. And Baltimore takes over again. I have a total of 58 reps so far in this game, which is not bad, but we're still down 7 3. And the Ravens did the ball after halftime, but we did the ball back right now, like 20 seconds later. Sorry. Here we go. The goal is the end of half. Or the goal is the, for the drive goal is the dip points. This is a screen here. We have two turnovers, both interceptions. This is a half bat slip, slip screen to Harris to the left. And he's got the first down. And he got way more. Still in bounds here. We have all three timeouts. I'm going to hurry it up here. Let's go with four verticals. See if we can sprint someone deep here. I'm going to have a one on one on the left side. I do. To Johnson. And. He got it! Touchdown! Get mossed! Deontay Johnson just completely mossed his defender. And the Steelers have their first lead of the game with 128 to down. Or, and the Steelers have the first lead of the game, 128 to down in the first half. What a throw by Vinny Jan. What a catch by Deontay Johnson. 43 yard touchdown. Steeler, or. Ravens go down, excuse me, and did a touchdown, and they're up 14-10 with 12 seconds to Dell in the first half, and the Ravens did the ball after halftime. We only, we only have 12 seconds, and we have all three timeouts, but I don't know if we can really do anything. I'm just going to do four verticals, see if we can get another moonshot, maybe, but we're down by four late in the first half, and the Ravens did the ball after halftime. Here we go. I'm just going to try another shot here. It's another one-on-one. -on -one. It's Johnson, and this one's picked off. And that's Marcus Peters, third interception for the Ravens, and for Vinny J, first for Peters. But I just wanted to give him a chance, but that didn't happen. I have one touchdown on three interceptions in the first half, but that shouldn't amount to anything because there was only six seconds left. It better not, but the Ravens did the ball after halftime and do not score, and we, and we did the ball 40 seconds into the third quarter. Here we go. Four touchdowns away from my season goal, which I almost likely did get there. Unless I get injured or something. I'm out for multiple weeks. It looks like the Ravens turned it over because we're at their 25. Let's turn that, turn this drive or whatever, this, the Baltimore turnover or whatever it was in the sixth. And he almost fell into the end zone. Dana, 23, first and goal from the two. That was, uh, I believe that's Fear and Muth. Here we go. It's a run up the middle by Harris. And he did in. Did he give us the lead bad? No, he can't. He lost the yard. Okay, I gotta do like a more. I gotta do a run and play. Uh, does, okay, let's do a quick slant here. First, set and goal for the three after losing a yard from the right hash. Here we go. And I'm gonna. I, that could have been picked off. I was hit as I threw. Here we go. Now it's third and goal. I mean, that turned out, I think that was an interception or a fumble by Baltimore in the sixth. It's another run by Harris, but no, no under goal on defense for Baltimore. Harris up the middle, and he is in. Touchdown, Steelers, and the Steelers retake the lead. Harris, 17th touchdown of the year, and it's now 16-14 Steelers. And now have 138 reps here in this game. There's still a quarter a half and change the dough and we're up by three and the Ravens go down and did a field goal and we're tied at 17. 17-17, one seventeen to go in the third quarter. Here we go. Wide open is that. Not wide open, but open is that. I have 210 passing yards. I also have three interceptions, but I do have one touchdown. One minute to go in the third quarter, 17-17. This game should be, shouldn't be as close as it is, but it wouldn't be if I had to throw three interceptions, but can't do anything about it now. I might have circle, and I do have circle. I believe that was Chase Claypool, maybe. Might be some, yeah, it is Claypool. First down, 
all the way to the Baltimore 10, first and 10, Pittsburgh. Here we go. This is, uh, I believe, a run to Harris, I believe. Yes, it is. And Harris is in, untouched. And the Steelers retake the lead again, late in the third quarter. Now we're up 23-17 with 11 seconds to go in the third quarter. Harris' second touchdown of the game. He was untouched in the end zone, Harris was. And we're up 24-17. Steelers go down and did a field goal. So we still have the lead. Let's go with one rush for 20 plus yards. Run 25, 315 to go in the. What happened? What in the world just happened? The game just crashed, and I think I thought it said it read that the stores and stats will not even count for this game, dude. Yeah, it, like, backed me out all the way to the main menu. Yeah, I think the game just crashed. And I believe it said nothing will count for the game, or will it? I thought it said it didn't, but I don't... That was a good game, too. We were up by four with, like, three minutes left. And uh, I'm not sure what's going to happen now. It might... Yeah, it... Yeah, it, the game didn't even count. So enough, what I just played did not even count. That was unfortunate. Yeah, so... <laughs> let's have to get back into the game and start it all over again. Well, that's just, I just, that means I didn't throw three interceptions. Well, that's, that's ridiculous, dude. Better not keep doing it, or I'm gonna... <sighs> well, take number two for this game. There's nothing count... Stats and stores did not count from this game. The first time. Hopefully it doesn't do it again, but man, we were up by four with like three minutes left, and we had the ball. Yeah. That was unfortunate. It hasn't done that before. I've seen if other YouTubers had it done. I know Amazon skip all this because I just want to get this game over. Not over with, but... Uh, so, do we did the ball first? No, they did the ball first, but we did the ball 15 seconds, or 45 seconds into the game as we begin. So, I mean, I still have 25 touchdowns okay. on the year. So, that is unfortunate. So, yeah, we did... We did the ball. We did not get the ball first, but we did stop the Ravens on their first drive. Now it's our first drive. Now let's throw it to Harris because he's open, and he got set seven yards, second and three. Um, so there, like I said, the Ravens head coach is John Harbar. Um, yeah. I'm checked in a deep. That could be a mistake. And, yeah, I'm just, of course, intercepted by Williams. So I think he had an interception in the first game that didn't even count. So, yeah. You would think I would learn from the first game, but I thought I had him. But, no, I didn't. So, that's nice. And the Ravens go down and get a field goal out of all that. 142 they go in the first quarter. 3 up in Baltimore. Here we go. Oh, that was a dangerous throw right behind a defender's ear, but it's caught. First down, Pittsburgh. I just pray it. I, I'm just hope, hoping that the game does not crash again. Wide open is that. No one was within 10 yards of him, and he's out of bounds. Ref, that's a late hit. He tackled him in the bench. He literally tackled him like five yards after he went out of bounds. How's that not unnecessary roughness, dude? Okay, under a minute to go in the first quarter. Circle is open. What a throw in that. Uh, and what a throw, and the receiver who caught it, which is our tight end, Jay Sternberger, is into the end zone. Touchdown, Steelers. 
second touchdown of the season, and the Steelers are up 6-3. As I have 67 reps now in this game, 61 of them were on that drive. And we're up 7-3, 37 seconds to go in the first quarter. Ravens go down and, in a and get a field goal. We're up 7 sets still, 4-27 to go in the first half. We're still up by one. Here we go. First play of the drive, wide open. I believe that's our other tight end, Fury Muth. Fire, fire Muth, or something like that. First down. Here we go. Here's Harris, up the gut. And Harris, oh, if he stayed upright, he would have been gone, probably. But yeah, eight yards, first down. Not first down, seven down and two, excuse me. As we're halfway through the second quarter, as we're at the Ravens 49 yard line, one point game. One point lead, rather, for the Steelers. And a hit as I threw, but it's still caught. First down. 112 passing yards for Vinny J. One touchdown, one interception. And that, I only have one, I'm six for seven. I'm six, only, I have six completions, and then the other, and then my other throw was the interception. Run the Ravens 37. Remember, and remember, we did the ball after halftime here in this game. And that ball is caught. Down to the 18, first down. And we're starting to move it in. Here we go. We're inside the red zone on the 18. And here's Harris. And Harris got three, two, setting out an eight. Two minute warning, seven sets, Pittsburgh. Here we go. Better win this game. And hopefully the Chargers lose. But even if we win this game and the Chargers win as well, we would still be the one seed. Because right now we're the one seed, so if we win this game, we'll stay as the one seed no matter what. And I'm gonna run with this and I'm out of bounds at the sixth yard line. First and goal. Don't want to take a hit though, I don't want to get injured and or fumble the ball. Here we go. Rolling out right again, and I took a hit this time. Got halfway there down to the three, second and goal. Let's give it to Harris here. It's an outside run, sort of. We got a motion from number 44 to block, I believe. Harris, and he is. Not in. Down to the one at third and goal. So with half bat dut, punch it in. One ten to go in the half. Here we go. Harris on third and goal and he's in. Touchdown Steelers. Here we go. We're up thirteen sets. One oh seven to go in the first half. And we and and we obviously did and obviously we did the ball to start the second half. And of course, at, right at the end of the half, the Ravens did a field goal. Four sentences to go in the half. Um, not normally, I'm not going to do anything. I'm just going to knee it here because I don't want to have a chance of a pit sits or something. So, knee it here. And that, and that's going to be the end of the first half. 14-9 Steelers. And the Steelers did the ball after halftime. So, it's, yeah, skip halftime. Uh, looks like I can return it. No, I can't return it. That's weird. I thought I could, but yeah, why would I be able to? But it showed like I could. But yeah, from the 25, one second into the second half, we have the ball up 14-9. We have two touchdowns. Ravens have three field goals. Here we go. Here we go, and that ball is caught. It's Claypool. He got 13. First down. And the goal is to have seven plus passing yards. And I, I just got that on that throw. Play pull, one reception, 13 yards. And oh no. And I throw it up and it falls into play. I should have thrown it away. Only my second depletion. Or really my first because the first. I'm 8 for 10. Eight completed passes, one incomplete pass, and then the interception. Here we go. Here's a throw, and that was a bad throw. I did not see that that could be a pit sits, and that's exactly what it is. 
as Vinny J got knocked down at the 20 yard line and the Ravens have the lead yeah and now we're down by one what did the ball bat down by two uh, yeah. no actually no they went for two it said like the Ravens went for two to be trying to be up by three and then it did it so it's 15 14 Ravens with 5 10 to go in the third quarter here we go. Here we go, boys. Not not for a pit sits it in. And that could be another pit, and it almost was. Now I think that was a die that just had the pit sits. And I gotta stop doing that. Here we go. Here we go. Some I'm gonna run for this, and I got almost 10. It's third and inches now. Third and inches from the 30. No, wait, I did the play just hit the first down, Harris. And Harris, of course he didn't hit the first down. As he lost maybe like a foot, now it's fourth and one. Come on, dude. And because it's a face of the franchise, and because I'm only a, I'm only, I only can control my quarterback, uh, they're going to punt it away. And thankfully, they didn't get any points, the Ravens is. They were still up, down by one. Three minutes to go in the third. Down by one. Here we go. And I was hit as I threw it. Like, come on, dude. This is, they didn't, this is not that good. Here we go. I hit the wrong button, and yeah, this, so I got no yards on that, third and ten now, everything's going downhill since that pit sits, here we go, here's a throw, and that ball is caught, to the Ravens 41, on third and ten we got like 30 yards, that's Beasley, first down. The Ravens 41, under two to play in the third. And here's Circle, and Circle got popped. Right when he caught it, Beasley four, four yards, sending down in seven. Sending down in uh, six, rather. Here we go. So I'm hope, hoping that the game doesn't crash again. Harris got four, third and two. Here we go, third and four now. Third and two, excuse me. From the 33, one minute to go in the third. We're on the edge of field goal range. I'm running it here. Probably was a mistake because he lost a yard. Should have probably thrown it, but I thought he could run it maybe. But and they're suggesting to go for it. I'll go for it, but I'm not gonna. I don't like those play calls. Really, no, I'm going for it. We only need three. 30 seconds to go in the third. And I'll throw it the circle. I don't think he's gonna get there. Why did he like? Why did he run so far back? He lost like a yard. And that was bad. That was bad. And the Ravens take over th at the 35. As yeah, that was a Jay Sternberger who lost a yard, and they did a field goal. So now we're down 18-14 with only 4:24 to go. Yeah, we might, we might get upset by a 3-9 and nine team. Hopefully not, though. And here's a throw. What a catch. Second in inches. Here we go. Down by four. Touchdown with Tito Davis to lead. A field goal wouldn't do anything. Here we go. There's Harris. First down. He has eight rushes, 18 yards, and a touchdown. So he obviously hasn't... Obviously, Harris hasn't got that many touches here. Three and a half minutes to go. We're down by four. We haven't scored so far in the second half. That's his open, and he's got it. Down to the Ravens 38, and there's an injured Steelers player. It's that guy, number 75, probably, probably an offensive lineman here. 320 to the go. It, is, it has been a dormant offense in the second half, but hopefully it can... Erupt. Hopefully it can erupt here. I'm gonna run it. 
And out of bounds at the 29, Dana 9. At five rushes and 30 yards. 3.13 to play. Come on, boys. Oh, no, there's a die unblocked, but I don't it away, but it's hit out of his hands. Now it's third and one. And hold on to the ball. No, run it. Please just hit the first down. I mean, it's a half bat, half bat debt here. And Harris is got it. Or five yards, first down and ten with three minutes to play. Three minutes. Here we go. Down by four. Here against Baltimore. Here on home, here on our home field. Here's a throw, and that ball is caught. Down to the sits, first and goal. With two and a half minutes to go. Here we go. Harris up the middle, and Harris is down to the one. Second and goal, and that's not it, it's a two minute warning. Two minute warning, 18-14 Ravens, but the Steelers have second and goal from the from the Ravens' one yard line. Uh, give it to him again. Iso. Second and goal from the one, two minutes to go. Here we go. And I'll give it to Harris again, and of course he cannot get in. It's now third and goal from the two as he lost the yard. I'm going to throw it now. And we have problems, Norm. Here we go. And here's a throw, and it's dropped at the goal line. Catch the ball. Dude, he had it, and then it was not that out of his hands. Now it's fourth and goal from the two. They have goal line defense out there. Much information. Johnson coming over the middle. And Johnson gets it. Touchdown, Steelers! On fourth and goal from the two, the Steelers get the touchdown, and we have taken, and we have retaken the lead, and we're up 20 to 18. Let's go! I now have 172 reps here in this game, and we're up 20 to 18. But the Ravens only need a field goal, and they have a minute 37 in all three timeouts. I'm gonna switch to Simmons speed to normal. Extra point is good, and we're up 21-18. 135 on the clock. Ravens only need a field goal to have all three timeouts. Come on. Not a good start. 10 yard reception. Pass not the way. Second and 10 from the 35. Incomplete pass. Now it's third and 10. Us, it's four on territory. Now it's fourth and 10. This is the ball game. And 13 yard reception to John Ross. Incomplete pass. Second and 10 from their 48. 15 yard reception to Bateman. They're out. Now they're at the 15, our 15, with 44 seconds, and it's a 15-yard touchdown. Unbelievable. Come on. And the PAT is, PAT is good from Tucker, and now we're down by four. 42 seconds, and we need a touchdown. We need a touchdown. We have all three touchdowns, 42 seconds, but we need a touchdown. We got those 75 yards. Come on. Here we go, and that ball is caught. And I'm going to call my first time out here, but good start. Good start here. Front two, that was the art, their 49. So died, died at 49 yards. Now throw it up, and it's incomplete. I thought he got it. 28 seconds. Here we go, come on. Can we pull it off? And here's a throw and it's caught. Claypool. 21 seconds, second time out, we're at, they're at, we're at their 24. Oh my goodness, this is insane, dude. Let's throw a corner strike, because it'd be one time out from their 24. First and 10, one time out, 21 seconds. Here we go. Here's a throw to the corner of the end zone. And it's incomplete. That was that was close. No way down. 16 seconds now. And he, middle of the field is open because we have one timeout. 
And I was hit as I threw it. Now it's third down. Ops, it's four down territory. Go with Burkles here. Beasley's one on one. It looks like Playpool's also one on one, maybe. But and I'm gonna throw it. That ball is batted down. Eight seconds, and it's fourth down. So we died at the first down, but really we died at the touchdown. Four verticals here. Eight seconds. I have Billy Dell. Here's a throw, and it's incomplete. And the Ravens are going to win the game. And the Ravens are going to win it. As we're gonna fall to eleven until, and the uh, Ravens will move to what four and nine. That's at the knee at once, and the game's over, and we lose twenty-five twenty-one. Yeah, that was that was well, the difference in the game was my pit sets, which I threw, and then I had what three interceptions. I still had two hundred two hundred eighty yards and two touchdowns, but I believe I had th two or three interceptions. Two touchdowns, two interceptions, one of pit sets. Yeah. 18 for 30, 280, 60% completion percentage, two touchdowns, two interceptions. And obviously one of the interceptions was the pit sets. Yeah, as we lose 25-21, as we follow 11-2, and, and the Ravens move to, what, 4-9. and nine. As... Yeah. That's unfortunate. That's unfortunate as we do lose the game 25-21. And obviously I had to play this game twice because the first game with like three minutes left in the game with us up what? And it was like 24-20. We were up 24-20 in the first game. First time I tried to play this game. And the game crashed. And all the stats and stores were, well, just disappeared and didn't count. And then obviously, well, Second time I've had to play it, and well, we lose 25-21 to the Ravens at home too, and they were three and nine, so we completely did upset by a three and nine team at home. But happens to everyone sometimes. And we're still 11 and two, but if the Chargers win, they'll be in the one seed, or they'll be the one seed. And obviously, like I said, that's episode of the series. will be the last game of the regular season against the Cleveland Browns. Uh, in week 18 at home here in Pittsburgh, and you'll find out when, when you'll find out what and when that's on this channel will be when I post it. And yeah, that's pretty much it. I hope you enjoyed this video, despite me losing, despite me losing. But I still hope you enjoyed this video, and I'll see you in the next one. Oh, did I time red closing the board if you had episode? Oh, did I time red closing the board if you had episode? Tell about them. Subscribe if you have yet. Tell your mom, dad, grandma, and grandpa, aunts, uncles, pets, and friends about these videos. And you know what? I'm going to see you in episode number 6 of this Vinny J Man 23 Face of the Franchise series. See you in episode number 6. And eat a lot of bacon and go Steelers.